Known as the fastest flying animals alive today for their high-speed dives, some people may not know that peregrine falcons almost went extinct in the United States due to pesticides. In the US, they went extinct along the eastern coast, but conservation efforts brought them back from the brink. Once federally listed as endangered in the US, their populations are increasing. Peregrine falcons are widespread and live on every continent except Antarctica. Some migrate thousands of miles each year along waterways to summer breeding grounds in the Arctic. Others remain in the same place year-round as shown on this map. Peregrine falcons prefer open habitats with lots of space for them to fly. They're absent from dense forests. These birds hunt from a perch, while on the wing, or even on the ground. Their most common prey items are birds. They fly high above their prey and dive down in a maneuver called the stoop, where their wings are tucked to make them more aerodynamic. Compared to other birds of prey, peregrine falcons have sharp, pointed wings in a sickle shape. This helps them slice through the air and dive at speeds over 200 miles per hour. That's three times as fast as a cheetah can run. Peregrine falcons have a special bone in their nose so they don't suffocate during these dives. They'll slam into prey, which either stuns or kills the animal. If that's not enough, peregrine falcons have sharp talons and a beak armed with a special point that's designed for breaking bird necks. Peregrine falcons eat all kinds of birds, like doves, vultures, and ducks. In fact, they were historically known as the duck hawk in North America. They'll also take bats from the skies, and when they aren't hunting on the wing, they'll rustle up insects and rodents from the ground. Just because they're top hunters doesn't mean they're safe. Peregrine falcons fall prey to owls and eagles. Their eggs are vulnerable to raccoons, foxes, and wolverines. These birds of prey remain with the same partner over successive breeding seasons, though if one partner dies, they'll be replaced within days if other singles are around. Males pick the nesting spot on cliff sides or in abandoned nests of other birds. They'll also nest on tall buildings in urban areas. The female lays two to six eggs over 48 hours. Once she has laid the last egg, she'll begin incubating. The male incubates them as well, but he spends more time defending their nest and feeding his partner. The eggs hatch after just over a month, but they hatch asynchronously. Unlike some other birds we've discussed, peregrine falcons do not kill their siblings and may even form hunting groups with their siblings. The chicks fledge about 40 days after hatching. They'll stay near their parents until they need to migrate. Or, if they don't migrate, they may stay longer. Parents teach their babies to hunt by dropping carcasses from the sky and having their babies fly after them. It takes about three years before they're ready to have babies of their own. Only about half of those born in a given season will reach a year of age. Those that do have an average lifespan of 13 years, though some can reach 20 years old. In size, they're about equivalent to a crow, though females are larger than the males. For more facts on peregrine falcons, check out the links below. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today. Thank you to our patrons, SpikeSpeagle93, Dad, and everyone else for their support of this channel. Thank you to everyone for today's request, and thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.